Okay. So, Hortensia, you can read with me. We'll all read together. Okay. Now. And then okay. you will by yourself. Y luego le sola y así puedo escucharte y, y brindar cual, apoyo. Okay. okay, Caribbean Examinations Council. Caribbean. 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 Examination. Examination. Council. 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 Okay. Um, secondary education certificate. Secondary education certificate. Examination. Yeah. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. So there's a small error in this. This these these should be three words. Okay, debe de, debería haber aquí estas deberían ser tres palabras separadas. Okay, te lo te lo voy a escribir en el chat para que veas. Secondary education certificate. En, Entonces, cuando la gente le pide a los trinitarios sus calificaciones y ellos responden, mm -hmm. I have five C-Sec passes. Ok, es eh, lo que están diciendo es que es esto. Lo que están diciendo es Secondary Education Certificate. Entonces, C-Sec. CISEC es el acrónimo, es, el, es la abreviación para Caribbean Caribbean Secondary Education Certificate. Second, okay, not me, because not feedback. Feedback, feedback, feedback. No, profe, que están sacando un carro aquí, no es feedback. Sorry. Ah, ok, ok. Mejor, mejor. Este, porque... A ver, y cuando, cuando todos dispositivos los agarra un uno de los micrófonos, el mío, el micrófono, Caribbean Education Set, es lo que es CSEC. Ok. So, we're going again. Vamos a seguir. Ok. Examination. Examination. Specimen. <laughs> Specimen. ¿Sabe qué significa specimen? Eh, Ejemplo. Ah, ok. Ok, es un, sí, entonces cogieron este examen del 2008 y lo están utilizando para, como, como el ejemplo. Ok. okay entonces luego... Okay. Vamos a seguir Spanish. 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 People one. People one. Proficiency. General. Proficiency. 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 Okay. Listening comprehension. Listening comprehension. Sorry, part E. Listening comprehension. Part, part E. Listening comprehension. Part B. Part reading B. comprehension. Reading comprehension. 
Read the following directions carefully. Read the following directions carefully. Each item in Each this Each item test in this test has four suggested answers. Has four suggested answers. Lettered. Letter E. e. B, C, D. Read each item. Read each item. 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 You are about to answer. You are about to answer. And decide which choice is best. And decide which choice is best. Y decide cuál es la mejor. Is correct? Exactly. Sí, profe, sí. Se oye un poco audio. entrecortado. Se oye un poco okay. entrecortado. Sí, no entiendo. Ok, me desconectaron y me reconectaron. Bueno. Así, así se pone a veces, profe. Sí, sí, sí. Ok, vamos a seguir. Heather, you following so far? Well, she's reading the English, but Very you know, good. I don't know the translation as yet. All right, good. Ok, so, sample item. Sample uh, item. Venezuela is, Venezuela is, Venezuela es. Los leo en español. Se los leo en español. A. Una ciudad. B. Una colonia. C. Un país. D. Un continente. Ajá, lee esto también. Sam sample answer. A. B. C. D. Sí, y. La respuesta correcta es C. C. Y está, som, está sombreado, ¿no? Se dice así, sombreado. Debes okay. answer. Lo dice IT. Es un país. So answer. Space. C. Has been shaded. Shaded. Mm -hmm. Ok. The best answer to this item. Okay. All right. So very easy, very, very easy. All right. So listening comprehension. All right. Section one. Did I skip the instructions? No. So we did the instructions. Let's move on now to general proficiency. Okay. So direction. You want to keep direction. going? Puede seguir. En inglés. Yes. Okay. Please. Lo de arriba también. Oh, Part yes. E. Part E. I think mm -hmm. one. Thirteen. Li listening. No. Se me corrige. Listening. So, yes. Listening, listening comprehension. comprehension. Listening comprehension. General. Proficient. Science. Proficiency. Okay. Direction. Pro Proficiency. Let's try that again. Pro. Pro. Fish. Fish. And C. And C. Proficiency. C. It's como pro fish and C. Así es, así es como se pronunciaría. Okay. Como pro. Proficiency. Fish Profinci. como pescado. 
Y NC, pero en inglés. N, okay. N, C. N, C. N, C. Proficiency. Sí, pero usted Prof... le trae. No... Uh -huh. Ok. General Proficiency. Proficiency. Ok, good. All right. Um, Forty-five minutes. Mm -hmm. Section minute. one. Minute. 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 Forty-five minutes. Section one. Direction. Mm -hmm. For each uh -huh. question, for each question in this section, you will hear a single statement just from the mm -hmm. four pictures está todo pegado in your test book booklet the one picture which show what the statement says the pen black blacking the como leo corresponding Corresponding. Corresponding space on the answer sheet. For example, mm -hmm. you hear, you see. Good. Okay, very good, very good, yes. So this is the example, okay? Este, okay. este es el ejemplo. So direction. For each question in the section, you will hear a single statement. Choose from the four pictures in your test booklet, the one picture which shows what the statement says. Then blacken, que es sombrear, o, o mm -hmm. negrar. Mm -hmm. Utilizaron la palabra como negrar. Blacken the correct. En el espacio correspondiente, la respuesta mm -hmm. correcta. Así es. Por ejemplo, escuchas, okay? So, so the example here is, you will hear, el muchacho va a correr. Okay, so you will hear, el muchacho va a correr. And now you have to look at the four pictures printed in your test booklet, okay? Mm -hmm. And the correct answer, you select the correct answer. Okay, yes. so you select the correct answer by shading it. Okay, mm -hmm. so. All right, so el muchacho va a correr. What would be the correct answer? Which one would it's, you shade? It's B. Hmm? B. B. B, B, B. Like this? Uh, yes. Okay, B. anybody else? Heather, what would you put? What would you put? I didn't put anything, you know, I just trying to get my feet wet with this. Okay. Malika, what would you put? Malika is there? Yeah, I'm here. El, the, the, what you would hear, uh -huh. el muchacho va a correr. And you have to select the right answer. Mm -hmm. Right? Which, which of these images reflects that? El muchacho. Muchacho. Va a el muchacho va a correr. What which is the right answer? answer? Okay. I see. Yeah, you're hinting. <laughs> exactly, exactly. El muchacho va a correr, which they would not do. I know. Eh, I know. Enten, entendiste, Hortensia. Heather me dijo que estaba dando pistas, lo que en el examen no se va a hacer. Okay. okay. Porque el... el el enunciado es el muchacho va a correr. Ok, tiene que seleccionar el dibujo que corresponde. Correcto. A esta, ok. A esta um, Malika, you want, you want to take a guess? 
Um, if, if I go to make a guess, I don't I see it D. D as in this? As in dog. Mm -hmm. Okay, why did you choose D? Because I seen it on the answer she did. Okay, why is it, why is not D? <laughs> well, the um D and D actually looks like the same picture, just male and female. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> so okay. muchacho is for me. Claro, porque en las dos está en posición para correr, pues. Sí. Aunque creo, sí, pero creo, la respuesta... si, si se pone a analizar bien, es la D, porque en, en la B está como haciendo calentamiento, pues. No. Creo que es okay, la D. Sí. Sí. Sí, es la D. Sí. Es la D, es la D, pero uh -huh. te explico por qué es la D. Es el muchacho. Es el muchacho que va a correr. Ah, Entonces, en la sí, a, es, si te fijas, en la, en la B es una, una falda. Y en la B está la chica de la A. Ya, ya, ya. Exacto. Es una falda, sí, es verdad. Es, es un, hay, hay trucos así en sí, sí como, o sea, como siempre. Siempre, siempre uh -huh. en aquí tienen, ponen trampitas es lo, así. Para eso que es lo que caiga. llamamos eh, coloquialmente en Venezuela, popularmente, me, <ríe> conchita de mango. <ríe> Conchita de mango, exactamente. En inglés, eh, el equivalente a conchita de mango sería bananas, banana peel. Banana peel. Ok, banana peel. Mm -hmm. Let me explain that mm -hmm. to Heather and Melita. Um, in Spanish, the equivalent to a banana peel would be conchita de mango skin right that's what we call mango skin right but um in 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 english culturally we are more familiar with banana peel mm -hmm. banana peel to, because the conchita de mango is what you step on and you slip on your fall mm -hmm. follow so yeah. so me 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 entendiste Hortensia? Sí, profe. Que en, que en inglés eh, hay, hay, tenemos algo parecido, pero es con el cambur, no el mango. Banana peel. Pero bueno. Banana peel, sí, que es el el burro, el La concha del campo. Uh -huh. también. Yeah. Ok, bueno. Este, vamos a seguir. Entonces, vamos a hacer estas. All right. Okay. So, question number one. Now, get ready to listen to question one. Prepárense para la primera pregunta. Ok. Question uh -huh. one. No se sienten bien. No se sienten bien. Okay. You will get Puedo 15 seconds to answer. Right? Uh, let's, let's see. Malika. Let's try Malika. Yeah, no se sienten bien. No Which se sienten bien. Quick? Mm. Yes, no se sienten bien. Which one? A, B, C, or D? C, D. Okay, Hortense, ¿qué dices? D. 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 Mm -hmm. Heather. I have no again? idea what it means. If I know what it, it means, I could figure it out. So I'm, I'm listening. When I learn, right. I will. All right. All right. At this point in time. All right, I'll give you the, in the exam, they will not do this. In the exam, no van a hacer eso, no? Pero yo, yo te... Well, I have to learn the words. My mind, have, I've missed a lot of classes, so I have to right. catch up. They say no right. siento bien. No, 
No, in the, what I was saying was that in the exam, they're not going to tell you, they're not going to tell you um, what I'm going, they're not going to give you the, they're not going to give you the, um, they're not going to give you the words. You have to listen, right? I did. So the words are no se sienten bien. Mm -hmm. No, so I'm going to put it in the chat. No se sienten bien. Okay, no se sienten bien. That's, the, that's what you will hear and you have to choose the image. No se sienten bien. Which means they don't feel well. Option D. They don't feel well. Right? Which one would you put, Heather? Well, the options. They, they plural. So two of they, them don't feel well. Exactly. So they focus a, on song. They're, they're singular. There are two singular that don't a male and a female, but then they. So is it is A? No. No, which no. one? So it's D. Right? As, oh. as Hortensia was giving it away all the time. <laughs> oh. D porque son 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 dos, o sea, no es, no es se siente, sino se sienten son dos. Y es de, 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 de sentir, pues, de, de, de salud, no de sentarse. Exactamente. Exactamente. Entonces, es, es D. And that's Option. why it's D. It's Option D because... D. Option D. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, the word, Mr. Khan, the word sienten is, is D? Yes. So, it's D. So, look at mm -hmm. this, right? No se sienten bien. Okay. Um, no se sienten bien. Comes from sentirse. The verb is sentirse. So yo me siento bien. Tú te sientes bien. Él se siente bien. Bien. Ok. Um, nosotros nos sentimos bien. And, um, well, I was told they stop vosotros. Eh? Vosotros os sentís. Bien. Ellos, ellos no se sienten bien. Ellos no se sienten bien. Ok, me han contado que en el examen quitaron el vosotros, ya no utilizan vosotros. Um, I was told, Heather and Malika, that in the exam mm -hmm. they don't use vosotros anymore. So, and vosotros would have made one. Vosotros os sentéis bien o sentís bien. Sentís. Vosotros os sentís. Vosotros os sentís bien. Pero me han contado que en el examen ya no, ya no utilizan vosotros. English for what? For exactly. ¿Será de bien? And is vosotros is English for what? You. Yes. Right. So let me put the English, right? So I'll put the English. I feel good you feel good he feels good she feels good it feels good we feel good and they feel good Okay, um, déjeme escribirlo, so, ya va, me escribí. Sí, no me, me avisa. El verbo, es el verbo sentir. Sentir. En inglés, feel. Feel. Correcto. Así es, feel. feel, así es. Y fíjate Ay. que no es, no se utiliza, no es reflexivo, no es, no se utiliza el. El auxiliar. 
El auxiliar, exacto. No se uh -huh. utiliza el auxiliar. Solamente. Sí, sí, good. Sí. Feels. Good. Ajá. He feels good. It feels good. Mm -hmm. We feel good. They feel good. Finish. Very good. So the next verb, la conchita de mango, the banana mm -hmm. peel mm -hmm. that was there in the exam was to confuse you with sentarse, okay? mm -hmm. um, which is to sit. So if you look at the exam, you would see that these in A, they are sitting in C, he is sitting, it's about sitting, okay? He is not sitting properly. No se sienta, no se mm -hmm. sienta bien, y no se sientan bien. Mm -hmm. Pero aquí, en B and in D, en la B y en la D, you will see that it's about how they feel. Mm -hmm. they, they look sick. You follow? The, yes. Pero como hablan de, de están hablando en plural, mm -hmm. no se sienten bien, entonces es la opción de porque hay Exacto. uno, más de uno. Exacto. Entonces, entonces voy a dar la conjugación del verbo sentarse. So I'm going to give you the conjugation of the other verb. There are two verbs there, Heather and Melissa. Yeah. There are two verbs, de sentirse and sentarse. So, sentirse, we just did that. Let's do sentarse now. Yo me siento. Okay, that is I sit. Okay, then we'll do I two. Sit. I sit. Me sienta. That is you sit. Él se sienta. El se sienta. Entonces, he sits with an F. Ok. El, ella, usted. Ok. El, ella, usted. Okay. Se sienta. All right. That is he, she, he, just now. He, she, or you, respectful, sit, okay? Usted se sienta, okay? So if someone comes okay. into the office, Heather and Melika, yes. someone comes into the office and you, they start a babble in Spanish, you can tell them, Usted se sienta, por favor. And then you come and look for me. <laughs> or Austin. Y nosotros, nosotros. I think that's what will happen. We look for you, Austin, after. Right. No, 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 but you all, you all, will, get, you all will get to it. You all will get to it. So nosotros nos sentamos. That we is, sit. We sit. Very we good, Austin. We sit. Right? They um, sit. Vosotros os sentáis. That is you respectful. Well, you plural sit. Yeah. But they, they told me they don't use that anymore. So, so this is what I know when I Esto es en tiempo presente. Exacto. Exacto. Todo en presente. Ellos, ellas, all of this is, is the simple present tense. Okay? 
simple present tense. Ellos, ellas, ustedes se sientan. Ellos, ellas, ustedes se sientan. Ok. Uh -huh. All right. Uh, that, that would be the masculine. The or you sit. Right? So this is why the, the exam tests your listening skills so that you can so that they're testing if you if they say if they say siente and you hear sientan you will you will get it wrong so what it said was no se sienten bien no se sienten bien okay so the answer is d which is correct which is que es lo que eh, Hortense estaba diciendo. Ok, este para la próxima. Eh, vamos con la próxima. Ok, este, Hortense, yo sé que este, la vas a pegar siempre, pero no diga la respuesta. Este, <risa> ok. Para, de, déjame preguntar, aunque, aunque yo creo que ellas ni siquiera te escucharon, ¿no? porque igual, igualito, aunque tú estabas dando regalando la respuesta igualito se equivocaron entonces eh, eh, creo que no importa pero bueno okay. pero por si acaso no. okay. ok so the next okay. question Heather Malika question number two right mm -hmm. question number two los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre Los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre. Los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre. Um, Mr. Tani, could you just repeat that a little harder? All right, all right. I'll put it in the chat. Mm -hmm. I'll put it in the chat. Now, again, in the exam, they're not going to they're not going to write out the yeah, write it out for you because then once mm -hmm. you see these words yeah. you will um you will figure it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. So um so the idea would be to learn the vocabulary. All right. So I'll put it here. Los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre. No, yeah, okay, so, um, Hortensia, como puedes ver, este, eh, suena, suena medio raro, ¿no? Más natural sería los jóvenes charlan al aire libre, o los, ¿cómo lo dirías tú? ¿Lo, lo dirías así, los jóvenes? Con su perro charla nada. Sí, 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 sí. Okay. Claro, está muy bien para okay. mí. Ok, no, bueno. Entonces, sí, porque si pusieras con su. Los jóvenes charlan al aire libre con su perro. Con su perro, es que como que si hablando estuvieran con... hablando con el perro, exactamente. Exacto, exacto. Uh -huh. Ok, entonces, all right. So, Malika, have a. Yeah. You want to take a guess? Los jóvenes charlan. Sorry, los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre. Jóvenes. Ah, good. You go which one? Sí. Aire libre. What do you think, Heather? I, I really don't know. <laughs> what? I'm learning. Okay. I'm learning. This isn't All right. I'll, I'll, okay. So, um, the young people mm -hmm. and their dogs are chat are chat chat outdoors. 
Okay, the young people and their dog chat outdoors. Los jóvenes, char los jóvenes con su perro charlan al aire libre. B, I want to have you to get to B. <laughs> no, no, you had it right. You had it right. Okay. You had it right. Okay. Had it right young, they say the young just... people, but they look like two adults in, in C. Right, right. Um, the thing about it is B, that's a painting. That's not a real dog. And what's B? B. Mm, B. Well, they, you see, they're not really. Comiendo, comiendo hot dog. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, so C so is B the only one like, where they're chatting. Like chatting. B looks like the plane, right? B looks like the plane and eating right. hot dog. Okay, right. A. There's no dog in here, right? Yeah. B, the the main activity is not chatting. Chat, okay, sure. And D, the, the they seem to be painting a dog. It's not an actual dog. Okay. And okay. K, okay. this is to Option C. Option C. Por qué? Por qué no? Por qué no? Por qué no B? Y por qué no B? En la, en la B están comiendo hot dog. Uh -huh. En la opción D están pintando un perro. Okay. En la opción C están sentados hablando y el perro está al lado de ellos. Ok, de acuerdo, de acuerdo. So, sí, yo estoy de acuerdo. El, el, la, la mejor opción para la segunda pregunta sería la C, la respuesta correcta. Ahora, mm -hmm. este, question three. We're moving on to three. Any questions before we move on to three, Heather? No, no, no. No, no for okay. me to the second. All right, all right, no problem. Let's go with question three. So again, I am talking a lot. In the exam, they're not going to be talking too much. Okay, you, este, Hortensias en el examen no van a estar hablando tanto. Yo estoy hablando mucho. En el examen solamente van a, solamente van a leer la oración. Te dan 15 segundos para, para responder. Que, es, que sobra tiempo, por supuesto, para ustedes. Este, y tiene que seleccionar su, la mejor respuesta. Entonces, la pregunta 3. Am, ambos caminan hacia la playa. Ambos caminan hacia la playa. Okay. Okay. Profe, voy a voy a voy a hacer algo un momentico y ya regreso yo. Dale, Mientras dale, tanto dale. pregunte ella, ya regreso, ya regreso, ya sería algo señor. Okay, both need to walk toward the beach. Okay, so Monica and Malika and um, welcome to the end. Hi, good afternoon. Hi, hi. So, all right. So, um, Kizzy, you, you have some people there? Yes. Yeah, okay, I'm hearing the people a lot. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so you, the, the, the third question, we're on the third question. The third question is, ambos caminan hacia la playa, which means, I just put it in the chat. I don't know if it's my food or what, but I'm happy here. Good people go. Okay. What the bitch yeah. 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 I see. All right, ambos caminan hacia la playa, hacia la playa. Camina okay. hacia... Ambos caminan hacia la playa. Now, observe that in English, you have to put, in Spanish, they can just say both. They don't have to say people. Both walk toward the beach. Okay, oh. so they're walking hacia la playa. All right, both walk toward the beach. 
I see. Okay, so you're putting C, Heather? Yes, what would you What would you put um, this B? Ambos caminan hacia la playa. You can repeat what you said? I don't know if it's my phone, but I... I guess All right, I'll put it in the chat. Ambos caminan hacia la playa, which means both people or both persons walk to the beach. Well, that would be C. So you'd, be, you'd say C. Malika, you agree with that? Yeah. Yeah, Mr. Right. Kani, I said, see, they walk, they say it walk to the beach, right? And not on the beach because they're just watching the others. Mm -hmm. um, right. Walking uh -huh. alongside the beach. And... Right. Right. Yes, so the answer is C. The answer is C. And let me show you the trick. The tricks are, of course, um, they say ambos. Ambos means both. Right, both can only mean two, right? Ambos. Okay, ambos means both, right? And both can only be two. So therefore it eliminates A and B immediately. Mm -hmm. And then the next thing they say is caminan hacia la playa. Okay, so B, they are walking on the beach. They're not walking toward the beach. Asia is toward. Okay. Asia is toward. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it looks like Hortensia is still um, doing something, but let's let's carry on. The point is, um, ambos you would get clues, right? So ambos is two, so it would never be A, it would never be D. Um, and yeah, and B, they're walking on the beach, and they're not walking toward the beach. C is the only one where they're mm -hmm. walking. What is that? You heard that, Melika? Yeah. That was this building, no? I don't know if it's in your background, but I can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Well, anyway. Um, yeah, what was I saying? I forgot what I was saying. I started having something. You were explaining um, why it was C, why it, they walk into towards the beach. Oh, and yes, the beach. right. That's explaining right. it. Yeah, so um, both, if we were to put both persons are walking on the beach, right? It would be B. ambos están mm -hmm. caminando mm -hmm. en, la, en la playa. What did you say, Malika? So it would have been B if it had, so what you said. Right, right, right mm -hmm. exactly. If, if it were... Let me put it in the chat. If it were ambos, if it was ambos están caminando en la playa, it would have been B. But because they put hacia la playa, clearly they're trying to make it make a point that the people are walking toward the beach, right? Mm -hmm. So therefore it's um it's C. Right? So that's number three. Number four, any questions on three? Okay. No, for me. I am game. Sorry. No, ningún problema. Con, con Google. Lo que pasa es que el señor lo tenemos que estar moviendo para acá, para claro, allá. Claro, claro. Okay. No, no. De, de, de prioridad de tu trabajo. No, no te preocupes. Este, entonces les estaba explicando por qué es la C y no la B. Que ambos. Uh -huh. ambos Significa que la A y la D sería incorrecto porque son tres personas. 
Sí. Exacto. Y en la B, ellos están caminando por la playa, no sí, hacia la, la playa. playa. Exacto, exacto. Muy bien. Ok, entonces vamos a ver. Más conchitas de mango, a ver qué nos pone si aquí. Ok, entonces estamos en la 4. Ok, entonces este, voy a hacer como haría el, el examinador. All right, so I'm going to do exactly what the examiner would do, which would be C, which should be this. Question number four. Mm -hmm. Los señores van a comer enseguida. Los señores mm -hmm. van a comer enseguida. Is it D? Es mansa. También, también puede ser ya van a comer. Los señores ya van a comer. Ya van a comer. Uh -huh. Ok. Los señores ya van a comer. Los señores van a comer enseguida. Ok. Lo, lo que pasa, Hortense, es que tengo un... Eh, tengo un, tengo un, te, te lo voy a mostrar rapidito. Es que tengo, ¿lo ves? Tengo un, un script, tengo un guión del cual leer. Ah, ok, ya, 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 ya. Exacto, entonces tengo que leerlo como, como va a aparecer. Sí, sí, entonces, bien. por eso, sí, es, es lo que... Aunque, aunque ya van a comer, también cabe. Este, en este caso no. O sea, lo que vas a escuchar es lo que va a escuchar. Lo que el examinador va a leer es lo que va a leer. Uh -huh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So, um, where will we? Los señores van a comer enseguida. All right, let me put that in English. The... Listen, I'm going to eat right away. The persons are going to eat right away. Ay, los señores van a comer enseguida. All right, um, who, who, who volunteered an answer? Is it C? C. Okay, your answer is C. Heather, what do you think? C. They would not eat right away. C. Mm -hmm. um, or Tensia? C. Es la opción C. Opción C. Porque en la A están como vendiendo, vendiendo comida. En la B la están preparando. Uh -huh. Y en la C ya les están sirviendo, o sea, ya van a comer, van a comer enseguida. Y en la D no puede ser porque es singular, es una sola Exactamente. persona. Exactamente, es una sola okay. persona y so, está cocinando. Yeah. <laughs> so you were all right, all three of you were right. So um, there's a thing uh, we have to teach Hortensia about, it's called Never See Come See. Right, so you are all right, so be never see come see and give yourselves a round of applause. <laughs> all right. Um, okay, so, oh shucks, I didn't ask Kizzy. Kizzy. The answer would have been definitely C. C. Yes, 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 yes. Sorry, sorry. I, I didn't scroll. I didn't see it in the button. Don't worry, that, that, all that means is that you get question five all to yourself, right? Um, so, Kizzy, ella tiende el mantel. Ella tiende el mantel. Ella tiende el mantel. Ella tiende el mantel. All right. That would be she um, attends 
to the ella tiende el man okay that would be destacar mm -hmm. you can just excuse me for five minutes actually i'm in the office right and i can right. take some stuff from minister the person don't there so i'll come back all right all right, all right. okay go ahead. all right go ahead all right ella tiende el mantel um Anybody wants to guess what that means in English? She. Mm -hmm. Ella tiende el mantel. Anybody? D. D. Yeah, I just get them. Hortensia, what would you say? Option D. D as in dog. En la, en la A está tendiendo la cama. Mm -hmm. En la B ella es una pañoleta, no sé cómo se le dice mm -hmm. ahí. No, no sé en inglés. En la C mm -hmm. está poniendo un, algo en el cuello sí, a otra persona. Tendiendo el mantel para que se seque, pero la opción de. Exacto, exacto. Ok, so you were right, Malika, the answer is D. Ella tiende el mantel, es like she's hanging up the tablecloth. Mm. Ok, so she. Um, the mantel song, and I can put her hands as Christmas song, right? That's funny, so. Yeah, it's, it's a, again, <laughs> it's a trick. <laughs> You see this, this here? Right. This can be some, I think the old time word for it was mantle. Okay. So, um, you know, kind of designed to trick you. And, but this is the right answer. This is the right answer. She's, um, now literally, ella tiende el mantel, literally is she attend to the table floor, right? But table cloth, um, así se dice yes. table cloth. Sí, sí, pero eso sería una traducción literal. Okay. okay, la traducción más práctica sería she and up the table cloth. Ok, y es posible que, que, que lo veas como dos palabras, es posible que lo veas como una sola palabra. Table cloth. ¿De acuerdo? Puede ser dos palabras, puede okay. ser una. Ok. Um, you want to read the instruction here? ¿Quieren leer la instrucción? Hortensia. Go on to the next page. All right. Question number six. Are we ready? Everybody ready? Yeah. Okay, question number six. Ellos miran mientras que ella le entrega el regalo. Ellos miran mientras que ella le entrega el regalo. So Malika's answer is C. C. I say C. You agree with that, Heather? Yeah. C. Kizzy, you agree with that? I think she's step away. All right. 
ellos miran mientras que ella le entrega el regalo mientras ella le entrega el regalo Ok, ok. Um, ella le entrega el regalo. All right. So, what's your response? So, you, you, you're saying, Malika, could I be C or B? Yeah, well, I just, yeah, I asked him. What, yeah. Mientras que ella le entrega el regalo. Okay, what would be your... Okay, it would have you'd have to pick one, eh, for the exam. Yeah, but let's yeah. let's hear what Hortensia thinks. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Mira, profe, ahí sí. En todas. En la A no, porque es un niño el que está entregando el regalo. Exacto. Entonces la A no es. La A no es. En la D tampoco, ¿por qué? No. It cannot be Porque hay un e. solo niño. Ah, exacto. Hay un solo mirador. Hay un solo, hay una sola uh -huh. persona observando. Uh -huh. Ajá. So we understand that, right? Heather, Kizzy, and Malika. Es, 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 en, yeah. es, en la, es en la opción B. Porque uh -huh. dice ellos miran y entonces hay, hay hembras y varones. Exactamente. Y en la, en la C dice, este, le están entregando a un niño y quienes están mirando son hembras. Exactamente, excelente, excelente. Es la opción excelente. B. Otra, otro aplauso, otro aplauso. So, ah. Melissa, <laughs> that, that's correct. Um, the answer is B. B. Because... Because mm -hmm. in C, if you look at the observers, the people looking on, are mm -hmm. two, right? Mm -hmm. So that mm -hmm. if if it were if if it was C, it mm -hmm. would be ellas miran. It would be ellas miran. Ellas miran mientras mm -hmm. que ella le entrega el regalo. Okay, so that would be the look on while she, she, while she hands over the gift. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. So that, so that the plural, it would not, it would not have been ellos, it would have been ella if it was C. So it has to be B. Okay. Because okay. In, in B, there is a female recipient and a female giver. In C, there is a male presumably recipient mm -hmm. on a female giver, but the two looking on are female. So the answer is B, right? Any questions on that before we move on to the last, second to last? No, for me, that's good. All right, yeah. El Conductor Maneja El Autobús. We almost finished. We only have one more after this. El Conductor Maneja El Autobús. The driver drive the bus. Ok. Entonces, Hortensio, fíjate que el conductor en inglés es como si se dijera el conductor conduce el autobús. Porque el conductor también es eh, driver. Y fíjate que un amigo falso conductor es diferente 
conductor in English is not the driver. El, no es el conductor. Me explico. Conductor is a driver. Con, conductor is a driver, but conductor sería como assistant. Mm -hmm. um, sería como no, perdón. Ayudante, ayudante al conductor. Conductor. Okay. You all follow it? You all follow that? Yeah. Okay. Me, okay. me, 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 me entendiste, Hortensia? Que el conductor, sí. el conductor, en, el conductor en español, en la traducción es driver. Driver, ajá, ajá. Sin embargo, sin embargo, aquí en Trinidad, cuando escuchas conductor, uh -huh. cuando escuchas conductor, no se están refiriendo al conductor, se están okay. refiriendo al, al tipo que cobra el dinero. Ah. ¿Y ¿Has tomado Maxi Taxi en Trinidad? Bastante, ese es mi medio ah, de transporte. Ah, bueno, entonces <risa> habrás observado que muchos de los Maxi Taxi tienen un, tiene como un señor que cobra el dinero, que es diferente, que es aparte del conductor. ¿Te has dado cuenta de eso? Son muy pocos, pero sí, sí los he visto. Exacto, y en, y en algunos autobuses más grandes tiene... Es, ahora con... Ok, ya llegó el almuerzo. Ya llegó el almuerzo. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You're being recorded, eh? So, so thanks, thanks. I'll come over there now. All right. Um, ok. Ella salió en, 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 en el video. Alguien, alguien estaba prestando atención, ¿no? Bueno, no es que digo, llegó el almuerzo, pero no, no, no vi lo demás, estaba leyendo. Okay. Bueno, no creo que importe. Eh, entonces, sí, el ayudante al conductor en, en Trinidad se llama conductor. Conductor. Okay. Sí, este... Mm -hmm. En los maxis grandes. En los maxis chiquitos también había pero creo que ahora con el precio de la gasolina y todo, creo que el, el conductor está haciendo todo solo. Okay. Is, that, is that correct, Malika and, and Heather? The, now that we have, um, now that gas prices are, are, are higher, uh -huh. people hardly have conductors. Is that true? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't travel, but that, do they still have conductors actually in the um, buses, the maxis? I thought so. Okay. I don't know how you, that, that, that's a critical job. Are you going to put him on out of wood? <laughs> I don't know. Anybody else knows? Have a, Kizzy, you know? What's up? They, they, they still have conductors? When you say a conductor is a driver. No, 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 the conductor. That's, that's exactly what I was trying to explain. Yeah. Hortensia, the conductor is Some a driver. Some must not, not all. Is a driver, oh. but, but the conductor, what we call a conductor is not a driver. It's what not we call a conductor. Some, not all. All right, all right. Okay, so the... Let's go back to the question. El conductor maneja el autobús. El conductor maneja el autobús. What's your pick, Kizzy? El conductor maneja el autobús. She, she in transit because she's just in locking transit, the building. Okay, Heather. She transit because she just six months and she's locking the building. Go for it, Heather. Which one? El conductor he, maneja el autobús. He drive in, he drive uh -huh. in the LCM. Um, one is so stand up, wooden thing, and one is helping people on, so we gotta be driving. So your answer is A. Yeah. 
All right, Malika, you agree with that? Yeah, because he's right. literally he's driving in that picture. Yeah, he's driving right. in that picture. Hortensia, ¿qué opina? ¿Cuál es la respuesta correcta? El conductor maneja el autobús. Okay, it sounds like she's busy, but the answer is E. The answer is indeed E. All right, to the last one. She's also working on, in class at the same time. Um, but don't don't think you are alone if you're doing that. All right, so the last one, L, L, okay, question number eight. Mm -hmm. Él está mostrándole la foto. 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 Is it? Okay, does, that, is what, that is what would be the translation. Right. Is showing her or him the photo. So what's your response, Melika? Um, just on B, B, no, A, A. So this is a yes. one. <laughs> yeah, all right. Um, he, is showing him. he is showing, he is showing him. It could or be her. him, it could be her. Showing him or her? Yeah, they have mostrandole. Mostrandole is showing to him or to her. Showing him. It could be. It could be. But the, what the first part is definitely masculine. El. So it's he. El. So it's he. So it could be he is showing her the photo. So yes. I don't know. I, I, I guess still in here. It's IB. He is showing the photo. Yes. I find A actually look like if he's showing her the photo. And it, the two pictures looking a little kind of weird. Yeah, confusing. Yes, because she is, um, I mean, B, she has the photo in her hand, right? Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. A, it, it, he has the photo in his hand, and it seems as though he's showing it out like she's looking into the photo. Right. 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 Okay, or say what you think. Option E. E? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why? Porque él, él le está mostrando a ella. En la B, ella a él. En la C, él está viendo. Mm -hmm. Y en la D, él está tomando una foto. Tomando. Right. So, so D is eliminated. It cannot be D because he's taking a picture. Mm -hmm. uh, C cannot he's be correct okay. because he isn't showing anybody anything. There's nobody to show. Right? So it's either A or B. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> 